Hey, Batman, there's a letter for you in the mail. Is it one of those fan letters? Because I don't read them. No, it's from Santa. What? From Santa? Give me that letter. Dear Batman, you have been very naughty this year. And just for that, you're not getting any presents. From yours truly, Old Jolly St. Nick. What? Holy moly, Batman. What did you do? I don't know. I don't recall doing anything bad this year. So, what are you gonna do about it? There's only one thing to do. Find Santa Claus. <laughs> but I don't exactly know what he looks like. But I do know that he lives in the North Pole. Wait! You don't know what Santa Claus looks like? Nope. Never seen him in my entire life. You've never seen him in a Christmas special? I don't watch TV that much. Or a t-shirt or postcard? I don't go shopping that much. What about the internet? I mean, come on! He's all over the place! Robin, if you question me one more time, I'll be coming after you. Okay. Well, here's a picture of Santa. Hmm. I could have sworn you have sharp claws. Well, I might as well get going. Oh, boy! Can I come too? Hmm, let me think about it. No! Ah, oh, shucks. But don't worry. Alfred will keep you company. Yippee, the butler. The most exciting people in the world. Glad to see you happy. Now I'm off. <laughs> Wait until I get my hands on that jolly man. He's going to regret putting me on the naughty list. Aw, oh, dang it. It's a stupid fog. Oh well, might as well put my headlights on. <laughs> what? I thought I told Robin to check those after that Joker incident. Oh, he's going to pay for that. Don't worry, Batman. You can figure this situation out. Wait a second. Is that a reindeer? Oh, I hope that reindeer's okay. What the? It's a fake reindeer. Who in the right mind would put a fake reindeer in the middle of the road? <laughs> Sucker. Well, since I stopped, I might as well need some help. Hmm, that house over there might be useful. Now listen here, Mr. Palma. I'm the principal of this school, and I say that we have pepperoni and sausage pizza on Thursday. Hey, I have to go. Somebody's knocking at the door. Okay, bye. Go Tigers! Sup, bro? I'm Batman. <coughs> oh my gosh! You're Batman? I'm like your biggest fan. I watch all of your movies, play with your action figures, and even own all your coloring books. So what brings you here to my house? Well, I was heading my way to the North Pole, but since it's too foggy out, I can't barely see since my headlights are broken. Oh. Sorry to hear about that. Is there anything I can do? Well, um... <sighs> Warner, with your hair so bright, won't you guide my car tonight? Would I? <sighs> Woohoo! Best day ever! <clears throat> Can I help you, sir? Yes. Is Santa Claus available? Yeah, he's available. Just go straight and make a left. Alright, but before I do, can you send this guy to a warm place? So cold. I can't even feel my mustache, but it was so worth it. Sure, one sec. Oh, Alright, sir. Come with me so you can relax in our hot tub. Thank you. Santa Claus! Oh, Bruce. I was suspecting you. Wait, how do you know I was coming? Because I'm Santa Claus, I know everything. So I take it you came here because you complained about you being on the naughty list. Yes, but I don't even get it. I save people from certain chaos, put criminals to prison, and everybody has been treating me like a hero. Now, answer me this. WHY WAS I ON THE NAUGHTY LIST?! Look, all those things that you mentioned are very kind of you. 
But the reason that you're on the night list is because you're not treating Tim with any respect. Who, Robin? What do you mean? I've been treating Robin very, very, very... You don't know what Santa Claus looks like? I mean, come on! He's all over the place! Robin, if you question me one more time, I'll be coming after you. Oh, boy! Can I come too? Hmm, let me think about it. No! Ash knows. What? I thought I told Robin to check those after that Joker incident. Oh, he's going to pay for that. Wow. I, I didn't realize I was harsh on the boy. I was trying my best to protect him from a certain cause, and even threatening him to come after him doesn't help much on me. I was too busy on my work and I don't even pay attention to him. I'm, I'm a terrible friend. Well, you know, it's only six days till Christmas, so maybe you won't be late to give him the best Christmas of his life. You know, you're right. It's not too late. Oh, thank you, Santa. I appreciate the advice. How about this? I'll exchange Rudolph for one night for you, for your friend that you brought along with you. Because I noticed that his hair is much more brighter than Rudolph's nose. Eh, I guess he wouldn't mind. It's a deal.